Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for November the 6th of 2019. Well, it is titled 21st Century M101. So what do we see here? Well, this is the galaxy known as the Whirlpool Galaxy, also known by the name of M101. And it is an example of a great spiral galaxy. And we're seeing it almost face on, looking straight down on it and seeing the great spiral arms winding away from the center. Now the colors in this one actually mean something and they are uh, set up to actually be looking at several different wavelengths and there is a mixture of x-ray ultraviolet visible light and infrared measurements put together and each of those has been color coded by a different color. So when you see the purple dots scattered around here, the purple dots are the x-rays. So that is taken by the Chandra X-ray Observatory. And you can see the purple dots which show the very high energy uh, areas. So examples being supernovae explosions. So expanding material hot gas from supernova explosions and from very intense binary uh, systems where material is condensing on to a neutron star or a black hole. So that's what we're seeing in those and they're very concentrated into specific areas. The blue scattered around is ultraviolet in that we see a lot of the outer spiral arms dominated by very hot young blue stars. Those stars many times hotter than our own sun give off a lot of ultraviolet light and in fact give off the majority of their energy in the ultraviolet. In the yellow uh, towards the central portions we see the Hubble Space Telescope data. So that is the image that we would normally see in visible light that is primarily where most of the light is being given off on the galaxy. And then finally in the red also tracing many of the inner areas would be the infrared data from the Spitzer Space Telescope. And that shows uh, again uh, shows the dust areas things that are warmer and does show some regions of star formation as well in the inner portion of this. Now within a spiral galaxy we will see a lot of star formation and much of what we see is associated with that the very hot blue stars that form and form and die within those spiral arms they don't live long enough to even make one rotation around the center of their galaxy. And then we see a lot of the dusty areas in the in the red colored here the infrared radiation that we see and those are again associated with star forming regions where gas and dust have been heated up by the stars that are beginning to form there. And we also again see the x-rays which kind of stand out not as a region of star formation but as the end of a star's life where we see uh, remnants from supernovae and neutron stars and black hole binaries areas that are associated with the ending of the life of a star the remnants that are left behind after a star has gone through its life. So as you get to look through this image you see all those different color coatings putting together from four different telescopes to get a really interesting view of the galaxy known as M101. So that was our picture of the day for November the 6th of 2019. It was titled 21st Century M101. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be the Titans daughters. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.